Welcome back everyone to Poppin' Often Beloved. Today, 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 we are going to be playing the Galactic Cup. I really wish they named these different. I'm just saying, it, Galaxy Cup, Galactic Cup, Starship Cup. I'm just, so we're going to continue the series that I started to create about going through the thought process that I go through to reach the top 5%. So you do get three tries. I always recommend that you start with the highest racer you have. The favorite is not what you should go for. You should go for the highest. And if you have a speedster that's the highest, use that. Usually they are the fastest, just because that's their design. Now, a lot of with this cup, they're, they're actually asking you to just play a whole bunch of Lilo and Stitch characters instead of playing the ones you own. I really don't know how I feel about that, but we'll keep doing it. Okay, remember to cut the corners. Remember, the first, the first round is just always about getting a feel. You know, the first round is nothing about... Um, it's nothing about trying to get the top, trying to be the best. It's just getting your feel. So you're just trying to see what the map's about, you know? Doing your thing. And you do get more than three chances, but on the first day, you get only three chances. So maybe we could have taken that top part. I think the top part is best if you don't have boosts. I guess with speed still, you don't really need it. Cut through the cut through the sand if you have the boost. Remember, if you're cutting through sand, gravel, whatever, you don't get slowed down because you have the speed boost. Just remember that. You can also jump over it to reduce your speed from the grass. So keep that in mind. Ooh, that's close. Woo! Right, so go there, take that, boost. Just gonna use that. I should've rounded that corner there. I really was like sidetracked by the item. Really try to round the corners as much as possible. Unless you need to get a specific pad or you need to get a specific item, just round these corners huge get the boost there make sure we don't stack the boost there we go keep going nothing too crazy and we could probably just hold on to this item Oops. actually not if we want to because we, we have a potential of getting a boost but this item is so good to deflect if people try to like bomb you or something did he just get a boost this is why I said that you should have, <laughs> I should hold it. But again, the potential of getting the boost is really nice too. These three boosts do stack on top of your manual boost. So keep that in mind. Around these corners. This is a really long track, isn't it? Put the flame down. Around the corners again. Here we go. See what we got. I think there's a lot more corners we could have rounded. But let's just see where we placed. Again, this first one is just getting a feel for the map. Nothing too crazy. Nothing out there. Okay, so we got the top 40% off the first go. That's not bad at all, it's not bad at all. All right, let's run it back, let's run it back. So we know there's a couple of corners we could cut. We don't wanna get greedy for items. If we already have an item, just forget the item. If you already have boost, forget the boost pad. You really wanna start cutting some of these corners. I already missed the boost at the start. I'm trolling, we already messing up. We're just gonna skip the item there. So we're gonna do. So roll of thumb, don't get greedy for items. Just remember that, be straight. It's about speed, it's not about the items. Although they do help. You just get the items that you know you can get. I'm gonna pop this on just in case Donald wanna be a little sus. Ooh, I think we're doing good so far. I think we're actually doing pretty good. Ooh, that might that might hinder us. Go this way. We don't have any boost. Remember, if we don't have boost, there's no reason to go the low route. So we just wanna take the top route. We don't want to use boost on the rail just because it doesn't give you more speed and you're just wasting a boost. Cool. Put the flame down. And we're looking around these corners. So we're just going over here. Wow. 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 Okay. Get off the grass. Boost again. Try to round that corner. Nice. We're going to try to round this corner a little bit. Just a little cut. Nothing too crazy. That boost going around this one. Perfect. So far, so good. You don't want to turn too harshly because when you do turn, you are losing speed. So when you think about like turning and running these corners, make sure you're not doing it too harsh to where you're like literally hurting yourself. It's not the drifting that gets you, it's just the slope. So we're gonna use our ability just so we can get something else. Cool, we got a boost, perfect. We don't really want to use our boost right now. We want to wait. It does stack, but we want to make sure that our boost is gonna be used on a really solid area. It's okay to hold the items. 
It's gonna boost now because it should run out by the time we get over there. Oh, it didn't. The air kept it. But you see, this is why you don't want to boost. We're just gonna boost again. I should have boosted that a little bit earlier so I can get the item. Now that was troll. And I rounded that corner pretty bad. It's all right, jump over so you don't get slowed. Get the boost there. Ooh, that's gonna be bad. It's all right, that's all right, we're chilling. Jump over, try to get that boost pad real quick just to get the boost, try to finish home smooth. Let's see what we got. Was it any better, was it any better? Okay, we're still the top 40%, so it's still top 40%, but we did go up, so we did go up. So just two races, we're already almost into the uh, next percent bracket. Let's keep it up, let's keep it up. I did mess up on one of them, I did mess up on one of them, which is why we cost ourselves some speed. So let's try not to do that again. Always try to pay attention to what you messed up on last time. And remember, these go for, this goes for days. So you can definitely look to make a lot of improvement within the span of some days. Again, don't turn too harshly. That The turning is what's gonna get you. Ooh, that was pretty bad. That was pretty harsh. Okay, that was pretty bad. It's okay, though. It's okay, well, we can make it up. We can make it up. Baby. Don't drift if you don't need to. We're just gonna use this so we can try to get a boost. Gonna use that one too. Don't really need those items. There we go. We want the pad. Oh, I messed up. Nope. Oh, intentional. Dodged it. There's always something. Is that gonna be the running theme of this? There's always something on the third. We're just gonna skip the rail just because we do have boost. There's always something on the third. Jump over to that. Remember, don't drift unless you have to. And if you're gonna drift, try to drift in the line so that way it doesn't impact your speed too much. Like that corner right there, detrimental to speed. If we can just not worry about that corner as well, the one we just passed up, we're straight. Ooh, but that grass there is gonna be a little rough. It's always the third one. What What is up with that? If you guys watched the last one, or if you didn't watch the last one, watch the last one. It's literally the third round is the worst round for me. Okay. Go. And keep in mind, I don't, I don't like buy the packs to level up my character or anything like that. I actually don't really like playing Stitch to be honest with you guys. I'm just playing them because that's what they're making me play. So I am kind of like at a disadvantage, so to speak, because it's not really someone I enjoy playing as much. Drop the rail just because we do have that boost, and we're gonna actually use this boost to bring it all home. Okay, remember we keep drifting in a straight line. Only turn when you have to turn. Perfect. It's all right to go through this. We got boosts. I'm gonna put that on just in case that guy's gonna try to use an ability on me. I'm actually gonna try something different. I'm gonna try to just cut that off entirely. I don't think that was the play. <laughs> I don't think that was the play. Remember, you're trying to trial and error. So their times isn't really that much different from mine. So the fact that I got hit like about two or three times, maybe even four that entire race, means that that's about a shave off of like maybe a second and a half or maybe two seconds. So I would definitely be in the top 20, if not the top 10 off of just playing three games and really paying attention to what specifics you need to watch out for. So again, I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, like I said, if you guys keep enjoying it, make sure you hit that thumbs up. I will be making more. I'll make one on every single cup that's released. I actually enjoy doing these. So. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate it. And until next time, know what I always say. Thank you guys for doing what? Hopping, hopping. Good luck.